Staying with Union Martyrs, the National Association of Western Doctors, NARD, is calling on governors across the country and the Minister of the Federal Capital Territory to domesticate the Medical Residency Training Act. Now, this would ensure the payment of the Medical Residency Training Fund to all Western doctors working in their state. With the exception of Bielsa State, which has already domesticated the act, the NRAD uh, leadership uploaded Governor Doye Dewey's actions and urged that the governors to follow his example. Speaking at a press conference to close the NAT's week-long annual general meeting in Abel Kuta, Ogun State, National President Dr. Temi Tokbe Oshodara emphasized the importance of implementing the MRT Act. The AGM urges all state governors and FCT ministers to domesticate the Medical Residency Training Act and ensure payment of MRT and the Medical Residency Training Fund to all resident doctors working in their states. The Medical Residency Training Act is more or less like a policy, a guiding principle for residency within the hospital so that we can have trained doctors and not quacks in several professions or several disciplines within the medical practice or specialty within the medical practice. And that is why we came up with the Medical Residency Training Act. And for some of the governors that have not domesticated this act, the lack of political will is what is stalling the domestication of medical residency training yeah, and the supply of funds for this training. Some of them do not have that interest to form medical residency. And you cannot expect a doctor to begin to fund out of his salary his own training. Because uh, for doctors, we are not only doing service, we are also doing research. The national president called on the federal government to prioritize the welfare of doctors. He also demanded continuous engagement with the Ministry of Health to secure timely waivers for tertiary institutions aiming to curb the ongoing brain drain. It's very bad. Sometimes uh, what has also increased this Japan syndrome or the brain drain that we are witnessing in Nigeria is because of the shortage of manpower. Because there is a burnout and most doctors want to ease their stress. And that is why some of them are looking for greener pasture or looking for where there is a better welfare for them. In Nigeria, we have a doctor attending to about 600 patients, which is way beyond the WHO standard. And this is increasing even, like, you know, one of our something dwells on mental health. And it is increasing the mental health and putting doctors in a state that is very unfortunate. And nobody seems to care about the mental health and social life of doctors. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.